we live in the era over managed services and this year just has started. And what we see now in the cybersecurity is rising interest to managed services. When a company just uh, um, requires some uh, specific services from the third party, from a professional player of the market. And if in the past such a specific um, activities like incident response you know, or uh, internal awareness campaign, cybersecurity awareness campaign, were just a prerogative of a local of, of their internal guys, internal cybersecurity experts. It's a common approach now when they first of all look for their third party that can deliver it in a cheaper way, with, with a wider range of services, quicker, with a better SLA than internal department and, and so on. We can uh, say that we live in the era over managed services and this year just has started. And if you speak about their, this uh, um, um, shift of paradigm from our the classic IT yeah, to the IT that's actually the set of services. What, what's, what's the principal difference? Yeah? What's the principal difference between their set of uh, license we can deliver and the service we deliver? In case of a license, you know, we do not take care about the final result. We just provide instruments. In case of the service, we share this responsibility on uh, the point that is uh, resolving of the problem service is to resolve the problem actually you know this threat intelligence could be of for me of two kinds the first one when i speak about strategic or analytical threat intelligence that is mostly about the reports and that's about the, the professional expert that can read it that can understand it that can make the proper conclusion after reading the, the customer specific report you know and the second more interesting from the point of our benefits and from the point of the size of the market is a, a so-called tactical or um, um, actionable threat intelligence actually that's a that's a record about the threat like the suspicious ip address or url which were involved in some criminal operations or um, SHA or MD5 of very particular uh, malware or command and control center or uh, many other things. We provide this information to the customer. This information should be ingested or landed to very particular systems and then uh, uh, traffic or just uh, uh, systems are scanned with this information in order to detect some, some traces of their malware. That's a point.